That's not a mission to take on lightly. Look at all those things. I call it the Legacy Nest. There's a corruptor in right in the middle, which I have no idea what it is, but I'm not gonna go there right now. Today I'm gonna go for the abandoned bunker. Welcome to Imperial and Galactic Savannah. So I parked myself next to the abandoned bunker. I'm gonna take the, the SV. Just so that I know that I'll be able to go back into the ship. And it seems like we got some sentries around here, don't we? Something shooting me. What the hell? And the thing is that my shield has no recharge, so let's go up. Okay, my Krogos at 95% seems to be holding on. Yeah, I got a shield, so let's see where they are. I got my lights on. Something over there. Nope. Pressing the wrong buttons again. Okay, one down. There's another one there. Okay. Anybody else? Yep. There you go, four down. Are they all? Nope. There's a bunch of them. There you go. And I think I'm shooting those little monsters that populate these grounds. Like this one. An overseer. Yeah, there's a lot of overseers here. There you go. There's still more sentries. Take a look around. Are there more on this side? Yeah, I'm not seeing nothing incoming. My crow was parked really close to the thing because I want to get the best possible coverage to be able to loot right into the crowbus. But if not, I'm also going to park this one right here. And uh, if I have to rearrange re the position, then that's how it's gonna be. Luckily, this is actually breathable, this planet, so I don't actually need to wear the helmet. Which is pretty good. Okay, so let's go into the abandoned bunker. And look at that. The thing opens up, it detects me. There's one sentry there. It's a big old hangar. just scour it out, see if there are any more sentries. So in terms of armor, I'm wearing the same thing. One radiation, one army, two multis. And uh, without uh, the EVA boost, it's pretty good. I don't think, I think I prefer to have more mobility, because this actually gives me a little bit more armor, 15 each. This one gives 50, but it reduces a lot of other things. Uh, so I think this is a good combo. Radiation is a 4.1, so Okay, for now, seems to be pretty okay. Maybe I could actually bring the ship here. Yeah, might not be a bad idea because it's a big hangar. Not big enough for the CV, but it's big enough for the HV. For the, for the CV. For the, God damn it, it's so many Vs, I don't know which one it is. For the Rekasaurus, let's say like that. Yeah, much better. I think I'm gonna park it right here. Now. I'm not sure, but I don't think I have a medical device on this SV. Oh, we can't even put medical devices on an SV, that's right. We can always put the uh, armor and the uh, oxygen, which is empty. And here I got the O2 tank, yeah. The medical device is only for HVs, that's right. Let's see, okay, I hear bodies around already. I don't think I have any more flamethrower. Let me actually check on the Krogos. If I got some flamethrower fuel. Yeah, I got some. It's not a lot though. It's not a lot. And I'm not sure, but I don't know if I can do it. Can I make flamethrower fuel? No. It can only be bots. Interesting. 
I mean, this is an advanced constructor. So the flamethrower field can only be bought. And I can't even craft the flamethrower. Okay. I wasn't sure about that. Pretty cool. Okay. Well, let's go. Um, I'm gonna try to put it on. And uh, if it's necessary. I brought the minigun laser. Laser minigun epic. Because I think it's gonna be more effective than the shotgun. The shotgun is a little bit slow. And I didn't uh, check if I can actually go through here. Let's see. Nope. This side seems pretty busted up. And there's no way in, is there? Oh, there's a door here. But it's out of action. Holy moly. Seems like this is not abandoned at all. <laughs> it's actually pretty... Pretty populated over here. What? Not abandoned at all. Okay, so I'm gonna remove the marker. This is gonna bug me. And uh, I don't know, is there any more doors? I think not. This must be the only door. So let's go. And it's open. Nice. Laser meeting gun. Let's see how good you are. Oh boy, they are level 10. Yeah. Gonna take a bunch of ammo. Holy moly. And I'm shooting it mostly in the neck and neck and head. But level 10, yeah, man. But that's the thing. Oh, there's more. Good thing I parked the ship right here. Come on, Rekasaurus, kill it. Shoot them all down. They're all enemies. Don't you worry. They're, they're not gonna be civilians here. <laughs> Even if they were, they would shoot it down anyway. <laughs> The ships always shoot down civilians for some reason. There's more? How many more? Yeah, point at the head. It's tiny and it moves a lot. But it can go down like the others. Yeah. Yeah, the lazy minigun I think was a good choice. And... Uh, oh no, not a good time. Oh boy, maybe I should get out of here. Yep. And I'm, I don't know what's on my back. This is not good. There's more over there. Holy moly. How many more? And I'm just uncovering the whole POI back with my back. This is not good. But I still got ammo. So let's... Holy moly, I'm in shit now. Oh boy, I'm gonna die here. Aren't I? Holy motherfucking shit, they overwhelm me. Okay, it seems like I'm gonna need the big guns. So, Plasma Blaster it is. And I have a rocket launcher epic in the in the Krogos, but I don't have ammo for it. I am gonna have to grab it. So for the time being, I don't think the flamethrower is gonna cut it, to be honest. Might not be able to do much, unfortunately. It's a good weapon, but no flamethrower. Let's actually bring... No, goddammit. The plasma blaster. Yep. And I think... Let me check what I got in the Krogos. In terms of weapons. So I got the rocket lock chain breaking me, but I don't have ammo for that. Um, I got another laser. The impulse rifle. This is a plasma rifle. I got the impulse rifle right here. Yeah, I think this is the best options that I got. But definitely plasma blaster. And another thing is the rate of fire of the pulse rifle is exactly the same as the laser minigun. Is even though it seems like the laser minigun is higher, but the diamond the minigun is just 80, and on this one is 140. So the minigun has less range, less, less max range. It just has a big capacity in terms of ammo. That's the only great advantage of it. it uses the same ammo, but uh, I'm gonna try with this one now. 
there's a lot of them, they keep spawning. And uh, I should have been a little bit more careful here. So I was farting in this room. Where did they go? Did they all despawn? They killed me and went away. Everything on the floor. This is not in good shape. Uh, yep, there's more over there. They are around. They didn't leave, as I was hoping for. Okay. There's an opening on the roof. Maybe I should take it, but let's investigate the rest first. Okay. Oh, goddammit. Scared me. Yeah, this one does more damage. What? Oh, Jesus. Don't open doors without letting me know, man. God damn it! Warn me about everything. Don't just keep moving things while I'm not logging. <laughs> okay, a nice syringe. Good thing I died. I didn't actually need to use any meds. <laughs> so, let's keep going. Okay, oh, some antitoxic pills. Okay. Let's pre-reload. Uh, I just wanted to be sure that on this level everything is done. Okay, another minigun. I don't think I looted it at all. Yeah, there was this locus. Ooh, is that... What was that? A medium, okay. There you go, okay, nice. So this is where I came in. There's another room to my left. Let's go over there. Larazino. Oh, there's a root. Right. One plant fiber. Spectacular. So are we clear? I doubt it. Okay. And I can go through here. Oh, there's a lot of cargo boxes over there. In an elevator. Holy moly. This is very convoluted. It's gonna be a long one. I can already tell. From the outside doesn't look much, but on the inside it seems like there's a lot of rooms to go. And they're fast, man. They're fast and nasty. There you go, let's try to snipe them out a little bit better. I'm gonna have to be more precise. They're a little bit hard to hit. They keep jiggling around, the head is really tiny. And my ammo situation is not excellent. Maybe I should reload a little bit more. Let's see if I can get a little bit more. I think I might. I was crafting some. Yeah, there you go. Let's grab some more ammo. There you go. And is this thing... No, goddammit, it's not T. A five. Holy moly. If I have to, I'm gonna go with a big one. Yep. I already destroyed a few things, so there's another hangar door up there. Oh man, but this is very... A lot of corridors. A lot of dangers. I can't open it up. Yeah, I'm gonna grab it all because there seems to be a lot of meds in these ones. Which are gonna be very useful. And in fact, let's take one right now. What about the ammo? Eh, not the ro Okay, not too bad. Some 50 mil, always useful for the CV.
that ammo. I don't think I... Yeah, it's for the base. Never use that one. Artillery for the CV, I think. Nice. The thing about these little boxes, they usually have just shit, right? But I actually found in a simple little box like this, an advanced core. So you never know what might find on one of these boxes, so that's why I gotta keep loading my mall. You never know. Might just end up finding something really good. Okay, I think that's all here, and it seems like it's a dead end, so I should really go for the elevator. Yeah, it looks like it's closed. I can't open the, the hangar door, so let's go back. I loaded this, yeah. I think I got it all. Yeah, let's go up the elevator. Um, okay, this is loaded up. This is loaded up. I like this weapon better than the, the heavy sniper. The heavy sniper takes way too long to reload. He only has uh, 11 or 13 shots. This one has more and it does a lot of damage too, so I think this one should be better. To deal with sentries and stuff. Okay, he didn't hit me. Oh boy. Okay, he was almost out. Holy moly. Even the scorpions are level 10. What the hell? Let's go meet again now. There you go. If the damn corpus get out of the way, it will be a little easier. Not gonna lie. Damn it. Not only I can shoot through them, I can see. Oh man. Are these dead or just... I don't know. Okay, just take it. There you go. Just get out of the stupid elevator. Okay. Sentries here. The monsters do all the legwork. No need for sentries, apparently. So, gonna put it all, even the meat. Oh, that's not the box. Why aren't you ever in the box that I want, man? That's amazing. Never in the right box. Let's bring some more of this. Uh, you know what? It might be better to change. So, detox kit, what does it change for? For antibiotic injection. I think I'm gonna pick up all the boxes. So detox kits, I got trauma kits, I got detox con contamination, and there's a fourth box, isn't there? No. So these three boxes take care of everything. I'm gonna thermal parasite. Yeah, this is takes okay. parasite, alien endo. And radiation burns too. Sickness poisoning burn. Sickness poisoning burn. So this box takes care of these two uh, injections. So let's bring this one. Antibiotics. Sepsis infect the wound. Uh, sepsis infect the wound. Necrosis dermal burn frostbite. Necrosis frostbite dermal burn. Okay, so this one is covered too. Fever attack, organ failure, food poisoning. Fever attack, organ failure, food poisoning. And uh, intoxication, poison and spice. Intoxication, poison and spice. And even indigestion. Yeah, so let's just bring these three boxes. This should cover everything. Not only that, they also give me 250 health. And the injectors, I don't think they give any health back. Maybe they do, I don't know, I don't remember. But there it is. Let's let's go like that. 
and maybe I'm not gonna need 22. There you go. If I need to, I just use one of those boxes. No, the moly dust got gonna run for it. Oh my, it's not being very effective. And they're close. Holy moly, they got a range, don't they? The thing doesn't seem to hit them. They don't get affected by blast radius at all. So in fact, I think I'm really gonna go for the flamethrower. I don't know. They just didn't get affected by the blast radius. I don't think. I had to hit them straight in the face. So I didn't even get the chance to... Yeah, that's the thing. I think I'm just gonna keep dying and not use meds at all. <laughs> I think uh, I'm gonna save a lot of meds on this one. Yep. They just really fast and uh, they have a range that... Uh, it's inhuman. Look at that. They're already here and I'm already damaged. I'm already suffering from some sort of illness. Oh man, where's the damn stupid thing? I'm gonna die again here. Let's take one of these, I don't know what, what it does. Let's take all of them. What do I got? Endoparasites. So, this should take care of endoparasites, right? And what's the other? Infected one. Okay, it kind of feels like a waste because I had to take two and I didn't need that much health. Yeah, let's go back to the injections then. <laughs> let's go back to the injections because I don't need that much health. I got this thing to give me health. Yep. So this is going to be a toughie. It's apparent. They're really hard to hit. And they do a lot of damage. They're level 10. And uh, my armor is not doing spectacular right now. And the thing is, I really have to run away from these guys. So I can't put another armor boost and take an, a multi. I really can't. And look, the radiation is 9 in here for some reason. Uh, so... I really have to go with the armor that I got. I'm just gonna change for a new one and keep going because I still haven't gone through the the second room on this damn thing. <laughs> Luckily I got a, a normal locker right here. I just need to access the Krogos to get some new one. And where would that be? There it is. So I got myself a new heavy armor. Yeah, I need the movements. I need the mobility. You know, I can't really... If I just tank it, uh, they're gonna kill me anyway. I don't think just standing there and not being able to move a lot because of two armor boosts uh, will be a good idea. I'm gonna have to fight it like this. I'm just gonna have to be a lot more careful. Because I did it already, what, three times? They just overwhelm me. Yeah, two or three of them is enough to kill me in two shots. So, I'm gonna continue here. I didn't go too far. <laughs> Let's see if I can do this in less than 10 episodes. That would be nice. Thank you for watching, and until next time.